So, here's number five. Some of you may like this game. I personally don't. This game was, had great potential. Like, this is Godless, if you don't know. This game had great potential. Could have went over perfectly. Like, I would have loved this game. But it it's a little too peaceful for me. Like, playing on playing with, like, my... I've played it with others online. Like, with my brother, I've played it. But seriously, we only had to play it once because it really wasn't that good on multiplayer. Um, so, and it's a pain in the butt to sculpt some things in this. Because, like, sculpting a mountain, uh, sculpting down a mountain will take way too long, takes way too much mana. Um, so... I really didn't like this game. They did make Goddess Wars, which isn't as bad because it's not peaceful. You do have to attack each other with uh, with your archers and all that. So, um, yeah. So that's Goddess. That came in fifth place. And I just told you the reason why I don't like it. Um, so we have the power to save our followers. Um, I did like the idea that when they get trapped in uh, your sculpt, your newly sculpted land, they don't just get trapped and do nothing and die. They do crawl out of the sand. Um, they now see you as their god. Great. So belief is actually how you power everything, but we can't start a town yet because we haven't even finished the tutorial. They did say there was a uh, way to skip the tutorial, but I can't see one. So that's Goddess. Came in number five. Sorry if you guys like this game. I really don't. Um, so, yeah. This is out of the Goddess uh, Wars thing. I didn't actually want to download Goddess. Um, but, you know. Because um, I don't have Goddess installed. I just have Goddess Wars. Uh, the only reason why I do have, why I have Goddess Wars is because you automatically get it if you had the original Goddess. Which I did. So... Yeah, it just costs a few bucks on Steam. Uh, so, now on to number four. What could it be? Dun-dun. 